going on you guys hope you're having a good day today and in today's video I want to show you guys how to change your images in affinity photo to black and white or otherwise known as grayscale and if you like the content please consider dropping a like and subscribing so let's get right into it to be honest with you guys this is a really quick process and all you have to do is go down to your adjustment tab right here click on that go up to your black and white right here and you will see a bunch of sliders show up uh, basically what uh, all these sliders are going to do is uh, highlight or darken the image uh, with that certain saturation uh, slash color. So let's hop right into it. If we're looking at the red right here, if we drag that to the left, as you can see the red saturation or red colors are going to darken and deepen. And if we bring up to the, to the, to the right side and increase the percentage of it, it's going to highlight it. So we just want to find a nice, comfortable spot right there like so. And as we play along with the yellow, it'll do the same thing, but just for yellow colors. Find a good spot there. Same thing with the green. And yeah, just have to play along with that. Another quick adjustment or way to edit your black and white images really fast is you can also go to your adjustment tab and go up to the level section. It's gonna be very top of your adjustments. Just select that. And you can see your t there's two tabs, or two sliders. You have your black level and your white level. If you adjust your black level and move that to the right, it's gonna uh, increase the black point of the image and make sure like all the shadows and the blackness of the image pops out more. And as you can see when I move that to the right there. And same thing with the white level, but just the opposite. It's gonna make all the white and white parts of the image uh, stand out a lot more, so it's gonna highlight it like so. So yeah, that's another way that you can edit your black and white images. Thank you guys so much for making it to the end. I know this one was a quick one today, but you know, this topic has been requested quite a bit in the comments and I just want to make sure that I get it out there for you guys so you guys don't have to ask those questions anymore. So yeah, if you do like the content, please consider dropping a like and subscribing. It goes a long way to help me put out content for you guys. So yeah, thank you guys so much and I'll see you in the next one.